All right, and we came to this plant for answers. Take a look over my shoulder. This is the Athens Material Recovery Facility. Translated, it's a recycling plant, a big piece of L.A.'s new garbage puzzle that's causing a lot of people frustration. Next week, the six-month rollout of L.A.'s new garbage program that focuses on recycling will end. And by then, all of the affected 70,000 customers in apartment complexes and businesses will be in a system operated by the city involving seven trash companies covering 11 zones and this $40 million plant for separating recycled materials. To date, there have been 20,000 complaints of everything from missed pickups or the lack of them. Those are those are very serious service-related issues. Dan Myers heads up the new recycling program that aims to meet a state mandate that requires California businesses to arrange for recycling services. It was a massive undertaking, but to some like Stephanie Gonzalez, the rollout is nothing short of rubbish. They take long to come and get the trash. Like... It smells really bad in the garage. And the cost to business owners like Carlos Hernandez is much more expensive. He says his monthly bill went from 111 to $312. It's more than double. I mean, it's, it's crazy. Is it fair to say that so far since July, it's been a bit chaotic? It's it, 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 it has been it has been a difficult transition within 15 minutes. Carlos Hernandez got three telephone calls. Okay. In the first one, it said what day his pickup was going to be. Your current charge day service is now being changed to Tuesday services. Five minutes later, there was another call from the same operator. Your current trash day service is being changed to Wednesday service. Five minutes later, there was another call from the same operator to the same location saying, Your current trash service day is being changed to Thursday service. You get the idea why that might cause confusion. I definitely understand why that caused confusion. I don't have the background of why those three separate calls were made. But to some, it's another example of a poor rollout. How the heck did this happen? I mean, why couldn't this have been a smoother rollout? Um, it's it's just a very tough process. It's it's a tough process because there's there there is no other way than to actually just start working with customers. We're going to put a phone number on the screen right now. It's 1-800-773-2489. Take a, take a note of that number, 1-800-773-2489. That's the number 24 hours a day, seven days a week, that you can call the city sanitation department and get help. What they're saying to me is don't call the individual refuse companies that come out to pick up your trash. If you have a complaint, a concern, something about your bill, call the city at the phone number on your screen. We're live in Sun Valley. Hal Eisner, Fox 11 News.